Brad from David Adams. We're going to be opening 07 Artifacts Football. I'm joined here by a sports card enthusiast as well as a local radio talk show personality, Mike Chope. Hey everybody. Um, 07 Football, loaded with rookies. Uh, Adrian Peterson, obviously, the yeah. big guy. Yeah, Peterson, and here we're in Buffalo area. Lynch and Edwards. Absolutely. So especially Lynch. So And Le Edwards, obviously, just coming on yep. at the end. So if you were... Uh, Plenty of guys, though. Great rookie class. A couple of them we don't really know we have yet, with, like Brady Quinn, for example. Absolutely. Jamarcus Russell. Good arm. Who knows, you know? Now, Artifacts has been out a while, but it doesn't make it any less exciting. That's true. And I think it's uh, Artifacts products and... Um, Produced by Upper Deck uh, for football and basketball and baseball the last few years. It's been going. I think mm -hmm. this is the uh, fledgling football year. First one? Yes. I think sure. that's right. I think that's right. So. How many packs do we have, Brad? Ten packs, four cards per pack, four hits per box. Okay. So take pick a side. All right. I will do so. We'll just dig them out and, and do it up. And anyway, we can. Stare at Ladanian Tomlinson in their powder blues here yeah. while we do I this. I like those retro jerseys. Me too. Do you? Me too. Yeah. Ready to start? Absolutely. Go ahead. Good, because I did. You have your base cards, and then you have, uh, I think, three parallels to the base card. Okay. Ray Lewis, number to 250, game used jersey. Purple. And I have a Super Bowl MVP, by the way. That is true. MVP. Absolutely. And I have an odd Andre Ellison rookie card from the Vikings. Now, I don't know how you like to open them. Well, this is a college picture anyway, but if Correct. it had been Vikings and you start to sort of scroll down, and that, that could have gotten really exciting, and then there there might have been a big letdown. No offense to this guy. Absolutely. But I know with hockey you know, cards. Kind of when I saw the purple jersey with the Ray Lewis, I yes. said, Yes. No it? offense to the guy, but. You're opening 0506 SP Authentic Hockey and you see Penguins and you get Maxine Talbot? Yes, yeah. or, or is it Colby Armstrong too you can get? Yeah. Yeah. Poor Maxine Talbot too, what did he yeah. ever do to deserve that? He's not a bad player, he's just no, not a just, you, you, you see Penguins, it's pretty exciting. Yeah. Okay, Artifacts rookie in this pack is John Beck, Miami quarterback, got some playing time last year. I would think they'd be hoping this year goes better. I would think than so. Than last year, yes, because I don't. If it doesn't go any better, mm. he's going to be uh, hanging out with Brody Croyle and you know. <laughs> nice prospect yeah. at BYU. Yeah, absolutely, cool. My rookie is uh, Matt Trannon from the Cardinals in Michigan State uniform. Pretty uneventful so far, except the uh, Lewis jersey. The fact they're college pictures, you remember, like these are. This, I think maybe, maybe came out in June. Sure, seven, sure. so. A lot of people like the college pictures, though. Mm -hmm. um, you have a lot of college collectors, enthusiasts who enjoy them in the college uniform. Mm -hmm. uh, it being a a non press pass product or a non college product with college, you know, uniforms pictured. So we've got nice a design, rookie though. number to ninety nine. It's Jordan Palmer, Carson Palmer's brother. Yep. Here with Washington, although it's a picture of him with uh, what? I'm not sure of the school. I don't even know. Don't UTEP? Know. UTEP. Miners? I, I think it was UTEP. Right? And I think he's... Uh, it's not mentioned. It, didn't they sign him in uh, Cincinnati now to be... I think that's right. Up? Yes, I think that's right. Cool. Jordan so, Palmer. Speaking of Cincinnati, we have uh, a card here of a guy who's been uh, much in the headlines lately. We'll have to see how that shakes out. Chad Johnson. Mm -hmm. A very awesome receiver. And a uh, guy likes to talk a lot. Right, yeah. Ocho Cinco. We've had, we've talked to him a couple times at Super Bowls. Just he's everybody's best friend at the Super Bowl. One of those guys just you know puts his arm around you like he's known you forever. There you go. And then he forgets your name. <laughs> <laughs> you can't forget his. I hey, think. look, we're, nice car design though. We're actually, talking, nice swatch all about how good the player is. And a die cut of the an A for AFC and uh, a glossy sheen to it, and it's numbered out of 250. Now, how come yours is AFC and mine for Ray Lewis is just an NFL cut? I, I, think, I think there's uh, AFC, NFC cards, which is the NFL logo. Okay. There's AFC cards, and then there's NFL artifacts. And there's uh, NFC, which would be an N. I see. Cool. Very good. Two left each. How are we doing? Eh? 
We'd like to see something more, I would think, and I'm sure we will. Okay. NFL photo shoot flashback fabrics. This is Tatum Bell of Denver. Does say event worn memorabilia, numbered to 350. So, two pieces, both dark blue. Uh, the, the makeup of the fabric's a little different. I have an insert card of Deshaun Foster. Uh, it's an NFL fax card, different from the base set, although a nice glossy design. Base cards, by the way, is Clinton Portis, get the idea, the big initials of the player behind the player. That artifact Let's style. See what my best base card is. I have a Peyton Manning. Did you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Marvin Harrison, Philip Rivers, or uh, Lax Bilberis, I guess. I go with Marvin Harrison on that one, though. I think so, too. Yep. Hall of Fame caliber, probably. Absolutely. One more for me. Darren Sproles, NFL Facts. Kind of like my Deshaun Foster. Right. Woo! Oh, look at that. I actually got a nice card. It is an Alex Smith photo shoot flashback fabric dual jersey autograph, number two of ten. That's nice. So, finally, after all those packs, I think we got a big hit here. Yep. Nice card. Number um, to ten, it's big time. Injured last year at the end of the season, but still has a lot of potential. You know, wouldn't you say? I, I wouldn't want to evaluate that, but I, you know, he was a first overall pick. He's the quarterback of the San Francisco 49ers. I didn't you say know. he was going to be awesome. He hasn't been. He hasn't been great, but that doesn't really necessarily tell you a lot about his his you know his value in the hobby. That's right. That's they, a, it's a great card. And they, uh, you know, they're. Uh, Kind of a revolving door with receivers. They did sign Brian Johnson. Right. And we didn't. And and you and I did not. That's, That's right. right. That's cool. That's a good one right that there. That is a nice card. An auto out of 10 with two pieces is nice. Yep. Can't beat that. And is it, may I look? Yep, absolutely. It's like the Tatum Bell in that photo shoot. Flashback, right. It is event worn, they say. Right. I like to look at that to see if it's game worn, photo shoot, you know. Differently. It says photo shoot on the front, but it does say event worn. Event right. can be. And they're clarifying a, a little things. more than they used to, which is a good thing. You know? Like it. I like the signature, too. You can actually read the name of the player in yes. the signature, which yes. is not something you want to take for granted anymore. No, it's not. They're absolutely correct. Very good. Nice, nice finish.